Isn't it great to be able to share your garden with other wild animals? Dad, that fox isn't wild. My mum's been feeding it for the past three months. It's pretty spoiled if you ask me. We've been feeding it breakfast, lunch and dinner. And when it doesn't get its meals, it throws a little tantrum, doesn't it, Dad? It does. But it's nice to be able to share your garden with wild animals. I it's, kind of like that. It's peaceful, Dad. It's peaceful, isn't it? Today, we have a hot and tasty video lined up for you. My mum, my sister and my auntie will be teaming up to harvest these deshi bangon to make some delicious pakoras with them. And we'll be showing you how to make a hot, spicy naga sauce. Hello and assalamu alaikum. If you're new to our channel, I'm Akib Ullah. I'm Ali Raja. Assalamu alaikum. If you enjoy the types of videos that we make, you should definitely consider subscribing to our YouTube channel. And don't forget to give us a like. Akib, I need some jalapenos. Oh, we've got plenty to harvest from, oh. sis. They're over there. Oh, which one should I take, the green or the red? I think you should take the red ones. Oh, okay. They'll bring up more colour. Okay. These ones, sis. Okay. I'll just cut them? Yeah, from the top. I'm just going to pinch it off just like that. We need to take about five. Yep, that'll be enough. I think you should harvest all the red ones from this one. Okay, there's one over there. You get it. These yeah. red jalape jalapenos are going to bring out the colour and the flavours. Is it a little bit sweet or is it is, spicy? is a spicy and a sweet flavour to it. Oh, okay. So it's a mixture of both. Yeah. Yeah. So what aubergine size should we harvest for this recipe? I think small to medium would be best. So we cut into little pieces. Okay, yeah. that's a plan. Yeah, those ones I'll okay. leave this one on there. Yeah. I'll harvest this one over here. There we go. Those look really good. Yeah, I know. They look really nice. Yeah. I can't wait to make the pakoras, especially with the chilli sauce. Oh, this is a nice looking one. Whoa. Get the medium to small size one. Yep. That's it. Get, get that one. That's it. Yep. There we go. Up here, I'm going to harvest this round aubergine. Yeah, that would give a uh, different texture to the other one. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, cut one round one, and then we can. There. Yep. Do we need any more? Do we need any more from this aubergine plant? Oh, look at that amazing. I think that's enough, yeah. We'll just leave them for another time. We've got quite a few over here. Yeah, that should be fine. I think we're set to go. And we need uh, nuggers, yes? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Should Fresh lemon. Dad, I think we're set to go now. We're set to go now. That should be enough. We are getting plenty of lemon. Have you seen that here? Wow. Plenty of lemon on this uh, lemon plant. Have a look here. We've get, we're have we getting a lot. Lots of lemon. Look at this one over here. Yeah, lots of lemon. I'm quite happy with this lemon plant. Okay, Aki, what spices are we using to make the gula? We're using two cups of plain flour, two teaspoons of curry powder. Curry powder is a mixture of spices that includes zira, oldi, chili and mustard seed. Some salt for taste and some freshly chopped coriander. We're going to add some dried crushed chilies for that extra kick. So how much are we adding? Should I, would this be enough, Dad? What, one, what, teaspoon. one teaspoon, yes. And that will give an extra kick to the butter. And now we're going to add some water to mix it. Add enough water Make sure your batter isn't too runny or too thick. Mm. 
I'm going to keep this whole aubergine. I'm going to just cut into four strips. Just like that. Okay, so this is going to be a first pakora that goes in here. Okay, it's coming nicely. That looks really nice, Dad. The inside. Right, we're going to slice this now into the big one, the round one, into about two or three mill, uh, about two or three millimeter thick. This thick, not too thin. Give it a nice mix, mix all the butter onto the brinjo and leave it to marinate for about 15 to 20 minutes. Now let's put this to a side when we make the naga chili sauce. To make this amazing tasty naga chili sauce we'll be using jalapeno, about six or seven jalapeno. We'll be using fresh garden naga. Put the chopped uh, jalapeno into a blender. A medium sized um, chopped onion. One red tomatoes. Some chopped, freshly chopped coriander. About three cloves. Two teaspoon of sugar. Some salt for taste, about half a teaspoon. And some freshly squeezed lemon. It's nothing better than using your fresh lemon from your plant that will that will give a nice kick to it you will have sweet hot and sour use a full lemon now blend it all together but not too finely make sure it had bits in it Yes, don't forget to add the naga chili. Almost forgot the naga chili. That's the, that's the bad boy we need to add for that sauce to be nice. Now wash the naga chili properly. Don't rub your eyes. Take that stem off. Now cut this bad boy into a few pieces. Oh my god, it smells. I can smell it from here. It smells hot. It, it smells, smells spicy. It smells delicious. That's the bad boy. Now let's put these bad boys in. Wash your hands. Dad, make sure you don't rub your eyes. Just add a little water. Not too much, just a little bit of water. How is it? <laughs> ah, it's amazingly delicious, but it's very spicy. Dad, that looks so spicy. It looks really spicy, but I can. <clears throat> it's going to taste delicious with your pakura. Isn't this amazingly beautiful? It's hot, sweet and sour. 
and extremely hot, extremely spicy. It's going to start, it's going to taste delicious with our deshi bangun pakora. It's time to deep fry your bangun pakoras. Add some oil into a pan. Before you add your pakoras, let the oil heat up. Crispy or your golden color, if there we go. Cook them until they're crispy and they're golden color and flip them around. Wow, look at all that crisp on it. Oh, that's looking nice and golden color. It looks nice and crispy, doesn't it? Yeah, I can't wait for that crunch in my mouth. I think we need to take them out now. Yeah, I think they're ready. I think they're ready to take them out. It looks really delicious. I can't wait to have this with the chili sauce. It's going to give it a boost. It's time to serve the sauce and try the amazing bangun pakora. Doesn't that look beautiful? It's going to be hot, spicy, sweet and sour. Not for the children by the way. My mum makes the best bangun pakora. Doesn't this look beautiful? It looks so crispy and delicious. Let's try the pakora with my dad's naga sauce. Mmm, it's so crispy and the naga sauce is so spicy but delicious. Look how, look at this. Dad, you need to try this. It tastes beautiful. It's so tasty. Let me try this. Let me try this. All right. <clears throat> it's really spicy, but amazingly delicious. The sauce is very spicy. It has all the things that you need in a sauce. Spice, sweetness, sourness. Mm. Give it a try. It's beautiful. It's delicious. Is the naga too hot for you? Pretty, it is pretty hot, pretty but hot I could handle it, Dad. I've had so much spicy stuff. I'm used to it. This is amazingly delicious. This tastes so nice. It's so crispy. It has all the flavors that you want in a pakora. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you have, please don't forget to like our videos. Don't forget to share our videos with friends and family. As you know, sharing is caring. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, do something amazing and hit that subscribe button. And hit that notification bell so you'll be notified every time we upload. Happy gardening. Assalamu alaikum and I'll see you in the next one.
stay safe assalamu alaikum and until then i'll see you in the next one Whoa, I had the spicy <laughs> pop. Thank you. Chili sauce on me, Palafine. Chili sauce on me. Now, me and I'm going to go to the house.